Hello guys, how are you today? I'm back here with this 13 hours before the new event starts. So this is going to be starting tomorrow around, I don't know what time it is now, but I don't know, 10 in the morning, thereabouts, my time, but tomorrow at any rate. So we are going to what, click on resume? Where was I? Anyway, tomorrow night, I will have my little farm, Ayrshire Estate, uh, whatever whatever is required for this event I will have it planted I will have the mod on the trick with the mod for you guys is you can harvest you can replant if it if, and I don't know what's in this this particular event if it's trees of course you won't be replanting it you'll just harvest and come back at the next season when it's ready again um, and keep an eye on that check the tree and if it's something that you know this t shows you right here what season it is right now it is winter at the Ayrshire estate so if it's a tree that is you know ready in the spring you could come to the Ayrshire estate maybe a few minutes ahead if, you, if you're afraid you know somebody else will be there I've just got a little a little farm nobody's going to notice this so you know a bigger one they tend to show up for more but these yeah nobody's going to be there at one that level except you guys who know about it but you know show up for the season that it's ready if it is something like a uh, if it's a field crop that you can replant you will be able to replant it i'll make sure the farm settings will allow you to do that and then if you leave the farm and turn around and come right back again You'll be ready to um, you'll be ready to harvest again right away, and and I'll be honest, there has been at least one time when that was not the case. I'm trying to think how to explain this with that mod that you've seen me use um, that allows me to you know plant something and it grows really fast. For whatever reason, it works with visitors. If they show up and plant, leave and come back, it's instantly done. There was one time, and I don't know if there was just some kind of glitch, where I actually replanted on someone else's property and the plants grew for me immediately. So I don't know if it's something that's changed in the mod, something that's changed in the game, or if it was just some weird one-time glitch. But I will have the mod on, and you will be able to come and visit the Ayrshire Estate of A Kiss for Luck if you're on the same server as me and do harvesting of whatever that event item is. And I, you know, I'll, I'll do my best to make that available to you for tonight. Fantasy Farm. We're going back here. Um, I did, you know, I've got the town redone. You know, after I finished, I went, looked at it. went, no, this is not right and moved everything. As I do, it happens. <laughs> if you show up, remember to sign the guidebook. Now, I've been asked about this pot of gold. You will notice down at the bottom it says 500 gold. Look at the bottom left-hand corner where it says pot of gold. I get 500 gold for this and one gold nugget. And so far on, wow, look at this. This is a, oh, this is Fantasy Farm, but I spend these here all the time. So I've got over a thousand here. I don't know what I have on my other little new farm, but they're they're just wonderful. They're absolutely wonderful to have. So this is my town square. Now make it work for you. You know when you're putting a town square in, um, I mean maybe you want a road down the middle and or the two roads down the middle or you know two roads and a row of trees or just low low cut flowers you can climb over maybe you don't want a long row like this you want it shorter with something on either side which probably would be better quite frankly but I just like the way it looks with the village green so I am trading efficiency for I have a village green you will also notice that I end up moving things again because this has the little seats on it, okay? This gets those little seats. I thought, you know what? That could be a waiting room for the train station. So I moved it over here. There's my little guest book. There's the pot of gold. And hopefully you can still see that there is the fueling station, uh, not you. You know, off in the back there it, where it says gas. I don't think it's too hard to find. I just kind of wanted it out of the way. Now tonight, I don't know, I'm, I'm thinking with my housing, no, actually I'm not thinking, I dreamed of this, okay, I actually had a dream about this last night, where all of the houses that I had, I ended up putting them, I don't know, somewhere with uh, like along a road like this in front, a center spot with flowers and trees, 
a second road that went all along there and then houses on both sides with their own each little garden and design for it just like a little neighborhood and in my dream I really liked it so I might totally go for that now it won't be all of them because this will be in whatever I do my industrial center because I'm not building anything on the moon and at least that looks kind of industrial this will be used for like I did last time for the um, you know like a tourism area I suppose that could be a house I uh, yeah whatever this is definitely a house um, house 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 no problem that will be at the carnival sort of thing this will be at the carnival kind of thing this feels like maybe maybe in my neighborhood I'll put in a park and I'll put in like this is a, a children's playhouse so that'll be in the park in my my neighborhood that one will be a house this is obviously carnival stuff and I think probably this is going to end up a pub again I think because you know I mean how many people live in a house that look like this but it's an excellent pub right totally good pub but I need to do where, are, where do they put these things somewhere in this place somewhere over the rainbow um, I'm not really seeing it here. Yeah, I am putting in a train system. I'm just not happy with all of the way it's working yet. And and quite frankly, I'm never going to use it except for the odd, Woo, this is a fun ride. So it doesn't really have to work all that well. It just has to go, Woo, it's a fun ride. Oh, well. I'm looking for the, uh, the little leveling doodahs you know what I mean don't I have those here already someplace okay let's see can I buy them if I can buy them then that means I don't I don't have them I'm looking for these I need these but it says I already own them there's so there's somewhere <laughs> Hello? <laughs> They're somewhere on this map. <laughs> I have no idea where. What did I do with them, God? Did, are they not showing on the map? They're not here. Okay, that's the warehouse. There's a fueling station. These are my shops. This is the little farmer's market corner. Um... I do have some random lights and bits where I was building things or trying things. I, I got messes all over I'm going to have to clean up. Where are those buildings? You seeing anything off in the distance that looks right? They got to be here somewhere, right? They got to be with the, with the houses. Hello? <laughs> I have no idea where they are. Uh, okay, let's try this again. So there are my houses. I'm back here. Right there. That's what I'm looking for. Woo! -hoo! I, I didn't think they were that far away. <laughs> my little butterfly comes swooping along to light the way. You little cutie. There they are. That's what I'm talking about. So we're going to pick these up. And we're going to have a bit of an, this will be my industrial something. We're just going to have a place where, you know, work gets done. And I'm, I'm wondering, you know, do I put it nearby? Here? Probably nearby here is smart. Maybe just right back here behind this stuff. Quite frankly, that's probably the best the best way. I'm just going to pop them down here for a second so I can have a wee look around. I don't these are not something you go to a lot because quite frankly, they generally are so expensive to level that, you know, you're not you're not just doing this every half hour. <coughs> the thing is, I'm not going to want this to see, you know, to be invading my town, right? That's no good. Do I put them back here behind the shops? That could be a thing too. Let's move you out of the way for now. Hmm. I mean, they, I've got a warehouse here, so that's not a 
putting them back here might not be a bad thing. But I think if I'm going to do that, I want I'm going to want that buffer. I'm going to want a little bit of a buffer between what's you know my shops and um, and what would be you know industrial bits. So if I put one of these one two. We could put a green, like a, an evergreen there and go one. Nope, you know what we should do? Okay, we're going to pick you up, sweetie, and move you over. Uh, no, I just built another one. That's, that's okay. We will give you a home somewhere at some point because I like trees. Um, the green, the dark, the, uh, the, the evergreens, conifers would have probably been better here. They're pretty, they're pretty solid. But we'll put a couple in the middle. How about that? We'll do that. Now, is there room to put everything back here that I'm going to want to put back here? I don't know. This one for sure. I want it nearby. I want all of my houses relatively nearby. Um, I mean, you could go... I can, all right, let's just try this first of all. Now, there's one other thing I want to show you guys, and this one you 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 want to do because it's it's good. This is your friend, okay? If I can find it, let's see. This guy right here, you put this in, and it doubles fuel capacity on every pump and station. It's a hundred ribbons. When you can, you'll want to buy this it's kind of sort of epic now I'm going to put this here and put yet one more tree between here and my town because because I am just because I am I'll put in one of these like so they're nice and solid you know you want that sound barrier between you know your 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 downtown and your bits of industry and all of these are going to go in there too these bits and bobs right here. Now I had thought about putting these, quite frankly, you know, if you've got an orchard, wouldn't it be cute to have the orchard there? Put it next to your flower shop. Actually, that's not a bad idea. <laughs> okay, just give me a minute to think about this, okay? <laughs> so this one is, you know, that looks industrial. That totally looks like an industry thing, as does this one. You've got the little pumps and you got the whatever. Now this one is, nah, I'm not sure. Like these are gonna change somewhat. This is, these are not leveled up enough. See, this one's got the tree ghosted there, right? But when I actually put it down, there's no tree there because it hasn't, it hasn't gotten that big and important yet. Now this one, I thought, you know, next to your, next to your trees your, or your plants or something, isn't that cute? The little place where you start your seedlings. It's adorable. And maybe once they're big enough, I will do that. You know, having this one next to my flower shop, isn't that perfect where you, you know, people can see your little seedlings growing and stuff like that. That might be really cute here. Next, you know, next to my flower shop over here. You know, it's part of that. Maybe in the back. I don't know. But for right now, I'm just going to leave them where they are because it is a convenient place for me to be able to do them all together. And it, you know, I have an industrial area. Ta-da! With little squitches of gold splashing out there. But it's all close to my town center. It's going to be really easy to, uh, to, you know, to pop over and take care of these when I, when I log in every day. So that's pretty good. I mean, it's not fancy. There's nothing fancy. There's nothing really, ooh, that's so sexy here. But it's going to be fine. Now, I had a light out in the wild blue yonder here someplace. Way over there. Let's go get it. I got some, some hedges here too, don't I? Why, yes, I do. So let's put that away. We'll pick you up. And... If I can get these, it's not going to let me do this. Got one. Sometimes these things are hard to aim for. Got two. Usually kind of cranking along like, there we go, like this. 
Like scooting up the side of them is usually better than facing them. Apparently not always. Can't get that one. Really? I got that one. I don't know why that one's being a pain, but you know what? I don't even care. I can get these. Oh, here we go. Look at that. We're just flying along. And this one I can't get either. Then I don't need you. <laughs> I'll delete you later. If you're going to be hateful, then do that. Do, 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 do. So we're going to put, we'll put a light right here. Like so. Actually, I could put a light in the back here too. And I'm thinking, you know, we're, we're just going to, we're just going to use the hedges that we, I mean, we've already bought them, right? We've already bought them. So they won't go with that. You know what? I'm going to move that light and we'll put one there too. Like so, like so. Just tidy it up a bit. I've already bought the hedges. I might as well use them, right? Sure. And like this. And like this. And if I had any more, I'd wrap it around. But I don't. But what I could do is take you now and put you right here. I was going to put a light there, but I think, you know what? The tree's, the tree's good. Can I not put a hedge here? Oh, I think I'm getting tired. Okay. Oh, there, 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 there. Nope, it's not going to go there. It's not going to go. So we're going to pick this up. Maybe. We're going to try again. Pick it up. There we go. And put you here. And then we can put a hedge in. Yeah? Nope. There we go. Okay. And it won't, it's not going to go, huh? sideways or like that? Eh, I'll leave it there. Can I put a bench? Probably not. But let's try. I, I don't think there's that's going to Well, maybe. You know what? It, it does. Oh, happy day. Perfect. Okay, there we go. So I got a little bit of an industry area here. The little pump's doing its thing. This, you know, it's got things. And it looks, you know, relatively industrial. Except for the <laughs> the plaid seat on the little music making machine and the fact that we've got we're painting flowers. <laughs> or actually we're going for mushrooms this time. Woohoo! Bring on the mushrooms. And good old old to joy is the highest. Yep. 24 tickets. You are my friend. There we go. And I could start doing these, but I just want to get everything built before I start investing 772 fish and 158.9, so 50, 159 million gold. I'm just not ready to do that yet. I want to make sure everything else is like set up first. I got a lot of stuff to buy yet, so... So where we've added a bit of industry, everything is, is quite convenient. I'm quite liking this. So I'll, you know, I'll log in here. I can hit the, my little pot of gold. Um, you know, can sell off things that need to be sold off. Just walk along the street here. Everything will be pretty easy to get to. And I just got to figure out where I want to put my houses. And I do want them nearby. I don't know, maybe the, the, the rocks and the ponds will make it a little messier to build in, but but it also makes it a lot messier to plant in. So I'm thinking this is probably probably where things are going to go. Let's grab a couple of houses. You know what? We'll do that for next time. We'll look at our housing next time out. And maybe if it's near enough, you know, it'll go from the housing right into, you know, oh, we get to walk through the little park. Tra-la, tra-la. To go shopping of a day. Oh, and we'll have coffee and a croissant. All the lovely little breads. I mean, look at them, right? Looking good. If you are a carboholic and who isn't, there you go. It'll be a nice little town. I'm going to be happy here. I think that's okay. 
I'm going to be a whole happy. So until I see you next time, guys, thank you so much. Patreons, I just thank you again. Bye-bye, guys.